Metabolism refers to all the chemical processes that occur within an organism. Metabolism is what allows our bodies to break down food energy into the types of energy we need to think, repair and grow new tissues, and to move our muscles. The principle that explains this big process is called the first law of thermodynamics, and it states that energy is neither created nor destroyed, but simply converted from one form to another. Now, let's take a look at the first law in action. The sun produces radiant energy in the form of UV or ultraviolet light. When the UV light hits plants, the chlorophyll in green plants uses that energy to drive chemical reactions in the plant cells through a process called photosynthesis. Photosynthesis essentially harnesses the energy of sunlight to convert carbon dioxide, water, and minerals into organic compounds and oxygen. So in essence, photosynthesis is the fundamental process that maintains life on Earth, because without plants, animals could not survive. In this animation, radiant energy from the sun is driving the reactions in grass cells to create and store starch molecules. Starch is really just a bunch of glucose molecules stuck together. Glucose is a simple form of sugar, so you can imagine that starch is a rich stored energy source. The first law of thermodynamics is again applied when animals eat plants. Here, a cow eats the grass and the cow's cells go to work, breaking up the starch molecules into their smaller glucose components. The glucose undergoes another round of energy conversion, and the energy from the glucose is used to grow new cow cells and to make milk. When humans consume the meat or the milk from the cow, the first law is applied again and the food is digested. During digestion, food is broken down into carbohydrate, fat, and protein molecules. These molecules are further broken down into individual atoms of carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. Proteins are the only molecules that also contain nitrogen atoms. Once the food is broken down into individual atoms, the first law once again describes the process where atoms are combined to make new tissues and usable forms of energy necessary to keep a human alive, healthy, and active. 